Hello, this is Buona from Buona.tv and today I'm going to answer a question which came by way of Twitter. On Twitter, this one came by, I'm glad they clarified it. It's Mr. Skate Rich and it's spelled M-R-S-K-A-T-E-R-I-C-H. Now I was going to say Mrs. Kate Rich, but no, it's Mr. Skate Rich. All right. And he wants to know, what would you say is better, boot camp or parallels desktop? So, Mr. 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 Skate Rich, Parallels Desktop. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna generalize this a little bit and talk about uh, virtual machine software versus dual booting because that's what you're asking. He says Bootcamp versus Parallels. Bootcamp is uh, Mac OS X solution to dual boot operating system, so you can boot to Windows if you want on your MacBook, MacBook Pro, Apple, Mac Mini, iMac. Mac Pro, <laughs> yeah, uh, you can boot to uh, either Windows or you can boot to Mac OS X, and it's one or the other, and it requires a soft reset, which means you have to reboot your computer, choose another operating system, and then start up again. Whereas with virtual machine software like Parallels and VMware Fusion and, and, and all the free ones that are out there, there's a bunch of open source ones that are out there, um, with those, you can run Windows alongside Mac OS X. So you don't have to reboot. What you do is you boot up a virtual instance of the operating system. So I don't think either is better. I think uh, uh, to answer your question, Mr. Skate Rich, it's not a matter of which is better. It's a matter of what is best for you. And in terms of boot camp or dual booting versus virtualization, I think it's a matter of resources. How much resources do you have available? Now, if you're trying to play games on your Mac or MacBook Pro or iMac, almost everyone who has any kind of knowledge of this stuff will tell you that Boot Camp is a better solution because all the resources are dedicated to your operating system. That means you can get the best frames per second, you can get the best picture, you can get everything because every little tidbit in that MacBook is dedicated to what you're doing in Windows. Whereas on the virtual side, you're sharing resources. You've got Mac OS X running in the background and you've got to share resources with Windows. So you're going to be limited as to what you can do. So tasks such as using Office, or web surfing, if you're testing Windows software, or you just want to use some Windows software for a couple one-off tasks, or if you just want to use Outlook to connect your Works VPN or something like that, those are ideal situations uh, where you can use a virtual machine. If you want to have a sandbox to test software, uh, if you want to use Google Chrome on a Mac, <laughs> you know, virtual machines is a way to go. Um, but if you you know you want to use all that soft if, if if you're a Windows guy you gotta you gotta have Windows all to yourself then that's where Boot Camp comes in so it's a situational type thing there isn't no which is better it depends on the task that you have now if you reply and say Buon well I play games I'm gonna tell you well dual booting or Boot Camp is probably best for you oh Buon well, I'm just gonna use Windows I'm just gonna try Chrome I'm just gonna use this software to do this do that uh, I got this software. Uh, that's not going to require a lot of resources. That's a key term. Not going to require a lot of resources. Then I'll tell you, hey man, got to go with the virtual machine. All right, this is one from One TV, Mr. Skate Rich. I hope I answered your question on whether you know you should go with the dual boot solution like Boot Camp or a virtual machine solution like Parallels. All right. So thanks for the question and take care.